There certainly hasn't been a shortage of lightning hitting the news this summer, from the golfers that were struck in Whitchurch, Stouffville, to the man from Lakefield electrocuted while filming storms, the beachgoers in California, to the family of four struck this weekend in Morningside Park. No longer is carrying an umbrella preparation enough to head outdoors. Knowing what to do outside when storms hit is still a bit of a mystery for some. What happens if we were at a big a music festival like Veld or uh, Caravana, the, the Caribbean Carnival Parade? What would we do then? I don't know. Oh boy, what would you do? <laughs> uh, I, I honestly don't know. Heed the advice from event venues, and in the case of the Caribbean Carnival Parade this weekend, the Toronto Police Marine Unit were on hand advising people that potential severe weather was on the way. There is also a potential for extremely heavy rain. So I'm getting ready for a day at the park. I'm using one of the many smartphone apps before I head in. Something like this is actually showing me real-time lightning right now. There's lightning down through Delhi, but these apps not only show you that real-time lightning, but shows you if the rain is on the way. And also some of them are giving you and me real-time access to Environment Canada watches and warnings right now. Hamilton under a severe thunderstorm watch in yellow, but no watches or warnings for Toronto. I can see the rain is incoming, but there's no lightning in the area. So that means it is safe to go in for now. <laughs> I would probably hide under a tree, but I don't know if that's the right thing to do. Probably not, yes. Okay. I would probably just go into the building next door, yeah. Indoors is the safest place to be, but if you do get caught outside, make yourself the smallest possible object by curling into a ball on the ground. Don't lie flat, as that makes you a larger target. Regardless of how many safety instruments you have on board a boat, being out in the middle of a lake is simply not safe. Get off the water. It's as simple as that. You hear it, you don't know where it is, you don't know how fast it's going to, you know, arrive on you. Just get off the water, 